To begin, hold your top right hand button for approximately five seconds. This will take you right into the settings screen. From here, we can set all of our different options to get our watch started. The unit will be default to English when you set it up, but this would be the screen you would change it at in case you needed to change a different language in the future. And to do so, you'd push the start stop button in the top right to open that, and your left or right toggle button to change the language. And to set that language, push the start stop button on the top right. And once that's done, you can move over to the next screen by pushing the bottom right toggle button to the date. All right, to open the date and set that, we'll push the top right button once. And this is where we can change the year, forward or back, using the bottom right or bottom left toggle button. And set that by pushing the top right button once. And from here, we'll move over to the month, which we can then change with the bottom left or bottom right toggle buttons. Setting that by pushing the top right button once. Moving us over to the day, which again we can change with these bottom left and bottom right toggle buttons. Setting with the top right button once. Our last screen is our format screen where we can change the format of the month, the day, and the year. Pick the one you want and set that with the top right button once. And moving on to the next setting screen, we'll push the bottom right button toggle button once. And here we have the clock. Entering that with the top right button once we can change the format of 12 or 24 hour with your bottom left or right toggle buttons. Setting that with your top right button once. We'll move over to the time screen here where we can change the time. Going up or down with these left or right toggle buttons to the hour that you want. Setting that with the top right button once. Moving over to the minutes where we can again change these with the toggle buttons. Setting that when you're done with the top right button once. And with that done, we can move over to the next screen by pushing your bottom right toggle button. And here we have gender, which will enter with our top right start stop button once, where you can change between your male and your female options, and setting that with your toggle button, or your start start stop button, top right. Once that's done, we can move over to our next setting here, which is your date of birth, Entering with your start stop button on the top right. Ascending or descending with your bottom left or bottom right toggle buttons. Setting that with your top right, you can move over to your month. Which you again move up or down with your left or right bottom toggle buttons. Setting that top right. And then with the day here, again, you have your left or right toggle buttons to change that up or down, setting it with the top right button once. Once that's setting done, you can move over to the next screen, bottom right button once, and here we have the weight setting. We'll enter that with the top right button once, which will have an option between pounds or kilograms, setting that and changing it with the bottom left or right toggle buttons. And once you've found that one you want, save it and move on with your top right start stop button. Push that once. And here's the weight screen where you can change this up or down with your bottom and left, bottom left and bottom right toggle buttons. All right, that setting's done. All right, after you've set your weight, our next screen is going to be your heart rate max. This will be preset after you've already done your other settings such as your weight, your gender, and your age. So this you can leave or you can change individually if you choose to do so. After this, you have your other training zones which again will be preset after those other functions have been uh, entered in. After this we have total time which you can change if you choose to. If not, you can leave B. Our other functions are total calories which you can change the screen contrast, and your button tone, and zone alarm. So after this you're back to language. You can exit the setting mode by holding your bottom right toggle button for three seconds. And you'll be back to the main screen.
and you're all set.